Hello, everyone. In a bid to ease the referral request process and increase the turnaround time for its approval, a new feature has been added to the provider portal to allow each facility generate referral requests for a release. So this would enable them to access secondary services outside their chosen facility. This demo video shows you how to initiate referral requests from the provider's portal. Now, the first thing to do is to log into the provider portal, which I have done here. And then I proceed to the verify eligibility module. I click on it. This would enable me to input the release number. When I'm done imputing the number, I click on the search button. So every enrollee has a membership number. That's an, an individual number. So the membership number is just um, the surface attached to the policy number, which is 012345. Now, what you're expected to do is to select the specific individual that you want to refer out. So in this case, I would be selecting Prince Love. Now, this process is just the same process for um, verifying a release. It's just the same process. You go to the box with mobile number, you tick the box, and then you click on the verify button. Now, the system has generated a verification code which you're expected to copy and then proceed to utilization module. You can either click this button or you come back here and click the utilization button and then paste the verification number that you have copied in this box, click on the search button and click on update. So this process is very similar to the same way you generate PA requests or you impute your encounter details. Now for referral, you definitely need a diagnosis. So for referral, the patient would have seen the GP and of course a diagnosis would have been given. So you can impute the diagnosis. For the purpose of this video, we're going to be using a dental case. So I'll pick dental caries as my diagnosis. And then I save. It's very important to save. And then I scroll down a bit, down the page a bit to the header with utilization, which is this. Now, for dental caries, I would be referring for dental consult because I do not know what services the dentist would want to render to the patient. So I would refer for dental consult. So I leave it as consultation. I leave my feature type to consultation. I impute the facility name I'm referring to. And then I pick dental for dental consults. Then I click on apply button. Now, once I can see that the services I have picked is appearing on the um, page, I proceed to request P. I click on request P. However, if I have additional information, I can input my additional information at the referral provider remarks um, box. I can input additional information there so that the hospital I'm referring to, all the people to approve it, 
can see what information I have inputted. It's quite straightforward, it's very easy. So once I'm done with all of this, I click on the replace PA code. And then once I get this pop-up message on the screen telling me that the PA request has been sent, I know that the TPAs that will approve it can now see my request. Now, once you're done with this um, section, you would get, once the TPA has approved the referral, you will get an automated mail, a portal of initiated autom um, automated mail that has an approval code attached to it. I'm sure everybody knows what this mail look like. It looks like it's something like this. So this approval code is what the referring hospital would use as their verification code so that they can upload utilization and pick procedures for this person. So you are expected to print a copy of this, hand it over to the enrollee for them to take to their referral hospital. And that's about it. Now, just in case it's not a dental case, if it's um, a CS case, you can just move to procedure, pick cesarean section. Of course, you apply here and then you impute the referral provider. Whatever services, you just ensure that the filter type matches the service that you're referring for. Say, for example, you are referring for investigation, you want to do x-ray, you don't have an x-ray machine in your facility, you just pick investigation, click on maybe chest x-ray, and then you click the apply button, impute the referral provider, and proceed with clicking on the request.